hi guys welcome back to my channel for those who are new here my name is maureen thank you so much on clicking on this video and if you have not subscribed kindly hit the subscribe button below like comment and share and for the returning subscribers you're welcome back guys please remember if you have not subscribed it's just somewhere here it's absolutely free there is no charges or anything so just hit the subscribe button and support your girl and i will really appreciate so so much so yeah let me give you a moment for you guys to subscribe because i've noticed most of you are just watching the video and you have not subscribed so kindly take this moment and subscribe yeah baby you don't know what you do to me between me and you i feel like chemistry i won't let no one come and take your place because the love you give you can't be replaced on today's video it's an interesting topic and i hope you'll really enjoy this video today so we are going to discuss about feminine hygiene i just want to give you tips or ways in which you can level up your feminine hygiene so let's start so the first thing first a body mist whether it's a mist, whether it's a spray and all that, you really need a good body mist. You really need to get yourself a good body mist. If you don't have it, I would really recommend you go get it because it's a game changer. Body mist, they are just skin scent where you start building your scent from there. After you've done your shower, you've used your shower gels and all that after the lotion then you go in with the body mist let me tell you if you have not tried this then you're missing out and this is this 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 is just the simple simple stuff that you start building up so that you can get that signature scent that you've been looking for or you want to have for yourself so me for me i like the vanilla scents because i find them calm softer and they really smell good you don't have to use a vanilla scent there's so so many scents that you can choose from so just go get yourself a good body mist and then that's where you start your journey of smelling good yeah so on to the next thing the other thing is a uh, body scrub this is especially to those people who have like an even skin tone you really need a good body scrub yeah because it smoothens it exfoliates that dead skin and leaves you feeling so soft so a good body scrub it's another thing that you should incorporate in your shower routines so that's another tip that you should know so another thing is there is um, shaving, waxing, or laser. It depends on whichever thing you choose. If you are not into permanent hair removal, you can choose to wax or to shave. It depends with whatever you're okay with, but I would say that you really need to either shave definitely just for your hygiene just for your hygiene ladies you just need to shave or to wax you don't need to keep that hair just for the hygiene and be clean you just need to shave wax or do the laser yeah another thing ladies another another thing that you really need to look out for is your nails actually your nails need to be done all the time not necessarily even doing maybe the tips or whatever just making sure that your nails are clean you don't need to apply anything polish gel or anything if you want them short keep them short and clean if you have those tips make sure all the time they are clean because as you know girls we always uh, use our hands to eat so if you don't really take care of your nails especially inside here 
it can be really messy because you get food it sticks inside so and that is not clean it's not hygienic so you always ensure that your nails are properly done they are clean and you're good to go so another thing that you really need to invest on guys it's a good good perfume because this is going to take you to another level yeah you see you don't really need to invest like in an expensive perfume but as long as it smells good it does not smell cheap you're good to go so a good perfume it's a must this one it's a must if you really need to invest in yourself you should get a perfume a good one at that yeah so the other thing that you really need to take care of it's your oral hygiene yeah you don't want to be talking to people and and they are irritated by your breath yeah so you really need to take care of your oral hygiene this is by using maybe a toothpaste a mouthwash or a scraper just to make sure your breath your teeth they're all fresh and clean yeah this this one you really this one you need to do it there is no excuse because you can imagine you can't just be going around having a bad breath and expect people to be very happy with you actually it's just disgusting it's just to be a clean girl take care of your breath take care of your oral hygiene and it will be good so the next thing is so you really need to change your underwear i know sometimes you as ladies you get you don't you don't remember to change your underwear often because most of the time you're going maybe shopping shopping for clothes for shopping for other stuff but you forget about changing your underwear you need to take care of yourself and you need to change your underwear as often as possible okay as you as you are taking care of yourself also remember taking care of yourself down there so don't forget to buy panties oftenly and all that another tip is girl you need to invest in some good silk sleepwear you need to have a silk pajama set yeah let me tell you there's nothing good like having a silk pajama set because it feels so good you feel so luxurious you sleep well if you don't have it find a way and get that and then you'll come tell me later yeah another thing guys is that you need to change your towels you are not supposed to use your towels for days for weeks and you're just okay with that no that's a no if not try at least at least once a week maybe at uh on the weekend then you can change your towel if not like a few days then just try and change your towels at all times you don't have to overuse your towels because if you use a towel for a long time it's not hygienic at all because bacteria and all that is in that towel so you need to change your towel and change them often okay we're good <laughs> I know today I'm coming on hard but I'm just telling you the truth and some tips that will really work for you so another thing is that uh, you get most of the people what whatever bath soap or body wash that you use for your body is the same that you use for your face no that is not good and is not hygienic because you can't be using whatever you're using on your body on your skin on your face your face is really sensitive you really need to take care of your face yeah so you really need to have a good face wash just have a good face wash yeah let it be separate if it is face wash it's for your face only and 
for the body wash you just it is just for the body let's not mix you're not supposed to use because it's not hygienic at all it's not yeah so that's a tip guys if you don't have any face wash find one because you need that so that's all for today guys i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please hit the like button comment down below until we meet the next time ciao